Yes. This is Vancouver calling. In some ways, the world of business and business around the world has changed. But in many ways, it has remained the same. I call Hong Kong, update my supplier prices, hang up and get stock quotes in London. The world has become a smaller place. We now speak, interact and trade together as a community at the speed of light. Exciting new products and services allow Chinese people everywhere to communicate in new ways. The electronic age has given birth to a new kind of bamboo network, the World Wide Web. It's also a place where people can learn about ourselves and each other. Sometimes, learning is about seeing. What we see is that, in many different ways, the contributions of our people throughout the world can be viewed through our stories of success. We have been able to earn a good living here. The economy is good and business prospers. Today, a new generation of Chinese people are entering international business circles. Setting goals and having the courage to take risks. The vision to see the future. We see enormous opportunity for your products here in Africa. Can we arrange a meeting? And helping to build healthy, safe, and successful communities everywhere. I've been living in this country for 37 years, and I'm happy. If a destination is a place where dreams can be fulfilled and where hope can be realized, and if people the world over can grow and succeed no matter where they make their home, then maybe a destination is only a state of mind. And now we come from the corners of the world to share and experience our common bonds. From here there is no certain path, no predetermined road. The only thing that is certain is change. And so, our destination is the future. <laughs>